nut jobs and welcome back to the lucid nightmare i'm your host as always jay schatzer and today well i have a splendid and fantastic anime flick lined up for us it is gusaburo suji's 1994 effort it is street fighter 2 the animated movie and this one is just all kinds of great violent fun so let's just dive into this fist fisticuff flick here is street fighter 2 the animated movie Street Fighter II The Animated Movie is an outstandingly outrageous anime flick that perfectly captures the spirit and madcap nature of the heralded video game. Profusely violent in its bare-knuckle nature and ultimately astounding in its raw presentation, this is one animated feature that will truly keep your attention and thrill your senses. Hyper to the max, Street Fighter II The Animated Movie is pure no-holds-barred ass-kicking fun. The film follows a sinister international terrorist organization called Shadow Law, who headed up by a ruthless and mystical mastermind named Bison, searches for the world's greatest fighter. Having scoured the world, Bison finally locks in on a martial artist named Ryu, who possesses great powers and unbelievable abilities that Bison wants to exploit. Unfortunately for him though is US and Chinese operatives Major Guile and Chung Li, who both have scores to settle with Bison and have devoted their lives to taking down his terrorist organization. With the match in fighters set, who will win this gargantuan battle of might? When it comes to pivotal video game franchises from the late 80s and early 90s, none come more to mind than the astoundingly popular fighting game Street Fighter. With its rough and tumble setup and overly wacky characters, the combination led to a cultural phenomenon that was just begging to be brought to animated life. Drenched in cartoonish violence and frantic style, director Gisaboro Suji vividly captures everything that we love about the long-standing series, and fleshes it out over a feature film length that truly encapsulates the insanity that is Street Fighter. From the supernatural aspects and powers of the various characters, to the overall look and vibrant nature of the entire world, Suji and company painstakingly mirror all of the elements from the original series, while simultaneously creating an entire living, breathing world for the familiar characters to run amok in. Inked in an animation style that purely thrives in that unabashed and unchained tone, the production is a mile a minute throwdown, which jumps from one outlandish fight sequence to the next, all in a pulse-pounding blur of broken bones and fractured skulls. It's the violent nature of the film and adult-oriented outlook of the production that honestly excels to push this frantic animated feature into unparalleled heights. In its brash and brutal approach, it plunges us into a world chock full of dynamite visuals and uncontrollable frenzied moments, all presented in the most expressive of ways. This is also supported by the hybrid soundtrack which features rocket-fused techno-driven soundscapes that match the wild atmosphere of the entire picture. It goes without saying that Street Fighter II the animated movie is a sight to behold, and with its traditional martial arts cinematic mindset, Mixed with its over-the-top and hyper-spastic personality, the combination makes for a spellbindingly rich animated feature, which truly earns the phrase, Balls of the Wall. If you're a fan of the legendary fighting game or just an admirer of violent, adult-oriented anime films, then check this one out as soon as possible. It's boldly bloody and exceptionally entertaining, and really that's all you need in an instant anime classic. To put it plain and simple, Street Fighter II The Animated Movie is an eye-popping and mind-boggling martial arts animated feature, which will truly knock your socks off as it kicks the living crap out of you, in unrelenting and violent glee. And there you have it, ladies and germs, the ultimately violent and insanely fun Street Fighter II The Movie. It is just balls to the wall, like I said, and just crazily brutal. Love it, and I've loved it for a long, long time. Just love this one. 
But guys, that's it for me today. Hope you enjoyed that one, and I hope you like what I'm doing here. If you do, please like and subscribe. And if you have time, leave a comment below, because I'd love to hear from you. But until then, I will see you with the next movie review. Take care.